Ooh, more dogs. Okay. We don't want to read yet. Let's look first. Okay. So, two questions. Two questions. Number one. What? Ooh, can you see yellow? Maybe not. Let's use blue. What do you see? That is the first question. So, if you are listening, you can type, you can tell me, what do you see? Hmm. What do you see? Hmm. So, I see. Hmm. I see dogs. Hmm. I see dogs. I see one, two, three. I see three dogs. Or I can say, I see some dogs. I see some dogs. And here we said the weather, right here, the weather is sunny. The weather is sunny. And how is the weather here? Hmm. It is snowy, right? So I see snow. It is snowy, right? So I see snow. I see snow. Hmm. I see snow. And we can say, it is snowy. Oops, that's really big. It is snowy. Try again. Okay. It is snowy. I see some dogs. It is snowy. Okay. So now, we can ask, what are they doing? So if you are listening, you can type and say, what are they doing? What are they doing? Mm. So to answer this, we use the same words. The same words. They are ing. They are what? Anyone have an idea? They are... You can say they are running. They are running. Right? And I see... I see this dog has Big eyes. Big eyes. <laughs> and his tongue is out. Well, it has a long tongue. And they are running fast. How are they running? They are running fast. Maybe they are racing. So let's read and let's find out. What is this picture? Lead dogs in Alex Crittenden's team run in the Open World Championship sled dog races during the Fur Rendezvous Winter Festival on February 29th, 2020 in Anchorage, Alaska. Whew. So, these are lead dogs. Here, the first thing we see is lead dogs. So lead means that you are um, in front. There are others following you. You are the leader. So these dogs are leading the other dogs. 
and we can see there is um there's a man or maybe a woman I don't know Alex maybe Alex is a man or a woman uh, who is riding behind the dogs this is Alex Crittenden these are his dogs or her dogs these are the leaders so the leader leading dogs and I don't know in I don't know in dog racing if the faster dogs are in front but I would guess the faster dogs are probably in the front and so these are dogs this is a sled dog race and it is in Anchorage Alaska which is in America so it's in America so let's see let's look at the map actually let's look at all these places on the map but we will start with Alaska so here is Anchorage Alaska this is where the dogs are racing Alaska awesome and let's go back to these other pictures and find these places so they are in South Korea so we can go to South Korea right here and actually they are here Daegu South Korea South Korea and the second picture is in Chile right there in Chile so we go back over here this is Chile Santiago South America and they are in Shanghai so go back over here to China and here is Shanghai China awesome great so <laughs> so lead dogs racing and thanks thanks for hi hello <laughs> welcome so I don't speak Russian but yeah thanks the astronaut can you translate it if you want to speak in another language it's totally fine I don't care but I will translate it or the astronaut will translate it <laughs> see I can just have a new <laughs> a new tab here I'll do it here why not <laughs> oh hello <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hello. I am from America. So we are learning American English. And here is America while we are on the map. I'm not here. That's the star, but I'm not there. I am from America. Welcome. Thank you for joining and saying hello. All right. So we are talking about these pictures from the Atlantic and these are the photos from last week we are practicing using articles so in every English noun we say a uh, for one thing and for one thing with a e i o u or the for one thing I know like this is a pencil this is the green pen Hmm, this is an apple and we are practicing these questions really this question what are you doing or what are they doing so here is our next picture and before we read my question for you is what do you see so if you want to answer I am listening I am listening to you. What do you see? Whew, this picture is very interesting. Hmm. What do you see? What do you see? Hmm. All right. So any. All right.
Alright, so anyone. And if you want to type it in another language, that's okay. Or we can practice English. And if you are not, if it is not perfect English, I do not care. We are learning and it is okay. It can be perfect, it can be wrong. You could say, I see a rainbow. That's okay. Ice. So the astronaut says, ice. Okay, yes. I see ice. Hmm. I see ice. So, here, it's very difficult to see what it is, right? I think if you never saw this before, maybe you will not know that this is ice. It looks very cold. So this is ice. And ice, we cannot count ice. Right? I cannot count the ice. It's like water. So I say this is water. One, two, three waters? No. Just water. Water, water, water. I see water. So ice is the same. I cannot count it. We say I see ice. Right? I see ice. Whoa. And I see snow. I see snow. Wow. I see it is very cold. It is very cold. Maybe this is a house. It's one. So we say a. Uh. Right? I see a house. I see a house. Hmm. Just one. Wow. I see... I see clouds. Right? And clouds, I can count them. One cloud, two clouds, three clouds. But sometimes there are so many clouds. We just see clouds. So I don't know how many. I see clouds. Clouds. Snow, I cannot count. I see snow. I see a house. Whoa. Okay, anyone else? What do you see? Have you seen this before? So let's read and see. Ice, great job. Ice forms on a house during a blizzard in Hamburg, New York on February 28th, 2020. So a blizzard is like a snowstorm. There is a lot, a lot, a lot of snow. It is windy. We can see here the wind. The wind is blowing. Whoosh. Blizzard. And it is in New York. So let's go to New York. Here's New York. And I don't know where Hamburg is, but maybe I guess it is close to the lake. Because usually when we see ice like this, it is close to the lake. So I don't know, but we can find out. Let's find it. Hamburg, New York. Hamburg, New York. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, it is close to the lake. It's close to the other lake. This lake. Wow. Very good. Cool. All right, if you have any questions, please let me know and say hello. Hello, welcome.